am Baroness Aurelia Hemlock, CEO of the Jacobs Corporation. I've just been informed that you rescued my brother. Disappointing. It's a family affair, and you've no business interfering. That said, vault hunters are nothing more than whores. So, I will simply pay you to leave my planet. Come to Jacobs Manor to negotiate your price. Oh, and when you see Alistair, tell him I'm rich. Why won't anyone pay attention to me? I do so cherish these moments when I can be alone with my many bowel-shakingly brilliant thoughts. Alistair's a rescuer in the flesh. Vault Hunter, you magnificent bastard! You did it! Now I am truly in your debt. Vault Hunter, my sister contacted you, didn't she? Yeah, Aurelia wants to pay me to leave the planet. That damn harpy! Anything Aurelia offers in one hand is only to distract from the knife in the other. If you set foot in that manner, she will try to kill you. Which is why we're going. Winnie! Vault Hunter, you did right by us, prying Alistair from the fangs of those zealots. Now, Jacobs is true to his word. I'll get you that vault key. But that means both you and I are going into that harpy's den together. The key's been in my family for generations, but the exact location, well, that's one secret my father took to his grave. You accept Aurelia's invitation and keep her distracted while I search the manor for the key. Why won't anyone pay attention to me? If you must meet with my sister, I shall speak plainly. Aurelia is one of the wealthiest creatures in the galaxy, but do not be fooled by the fine furs and priceless jewels she wears. She has the heart of a bandit. She takes what she wants. She believes in nothing but herself. If she had the charisma of Tyrene or the cunning of Troy, she would have started her own cult long ago. She has found her true family in the Calypsos.
mow down the Calypso's followers along the way. Followers, servants, all nearly as dispensable as vault hunters. A sacrifice arrives! Be 
On your stupid face. Bravo, thief! As promised. Not bad, Baroness. But you still owe us a vault key. I am working on it as we speak. Well, I will leave you to your fun. Good doing business with you, Vault Hunter. <laughs> this is awesome. We haven't really had a chance to get to know each other, huh? And Ty's been doing most of the talking. She does that, right? She's the center of the galaxy, and the rest of us just sort of orbit around her. But things are changing. Freaking look at me! I've never felt this good in my life! What? What is this? What is this? Your siren friend? She didn't know what she had. With this power, I can pull the stars out of the goddamn sky. You know, Tyreen says we should let you keep playing along. Yeah, a little competition gets our followers all riled up. <laughs> but I'm not one of them. No, not anymore. And I'm done getting table scraps. Fill your hands, you zealot scum! Huh? Oh, I'ma kill you! Come and get me, you rat-faced bastard! No plan! You search the cabaret!
here, old man. Try and catch me. What am I looking for? I'm not entirely sure. My 
my father said he kept all his records down there. Look for something record-like. Got it, Boyle. On my way back. Leaving so soon? Very well. <coughs> Let me at least explain myself. You mean nothing to me, so I sold you to the Calypso twins. But so you know, I will get the vault key, because I'm rich, and rich people get what they want.
Vault Hunter. So you spoke with my sister and lived to tell the tale. Never mind the harpy. That record. May I see it, Vault Hunter? Still can't believe the Calypso's murdered my father. I need to get my record player working, but you know Aurelia's gonna send all those damn zealots to find us. If we're gonna last long enough to open that vault, we'll need an army of our own. I'm talking a Jacob's resistance. It's time to take back Eden 6, and we'll start with the town of Reliance. I hired a gunslinger named Clay to lend a hand. He's waiting for you outside the town. Now that ain't the one.